Please join me in standing for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for 30 seconds of silence. Please join me in reciting our school motto. We are Durrell. We live by striving to be the best we can be. We learn by working hard and always doing our best. We love by caring for others. We leave a legacy by sharing our school with others and trying to make a difference in the world. Thank you. Please be seated. Hey, everybody. Mr. Walsh here. Today is September 13th, 2022. Here's what's happening at Saddle. Today is cheese lasagna with tomato basil sauce, baby carrots, fruit juice, white milk, and fat-free chocolate milk. For clubs, we have kindergarten through second grade Singers Company girls meeting Mrs. Glenn outside on the checkerboard at 3.45 p.m. Congratulations to those who made ORF Club and thank you to those who auditioned. Check the list outside of Miss Burgess's door if you're not sure if you made it. ORF Club will be meeting this Wednesday and Thursday in Miss Burgess's room 128 from 7.30 a.m. to 8.30 a.m. Rise and shine and be on time. If you were inducted into H NJHS last May in a ceremony in the NPR, please plan to attend our first NJHS meeting of the year on Monday, September 19th, that's next Monday, from 2.45 to 3.45 p.m. in room 221, that's Mrs. Davis's room. Please note this meeting is for the students who were inducted at the end of last year. We look forward to seeing you on Monday. There is still room for any 7th and 8th graders looking to join the Travel Club and to go to Washington, D.C. in March. The cost is $2,200, but we will be doing some fundraising to help pay for those costs, so the more we raise, the cheaper it's going to be. Any student interested need to speak to Miss Doan or Miss Gilligan. For sports updates, we had our first games for volleyball and flag football on Saturday and our first cross-country meet yesterday. Here are the results of those. Uh, for JV volleyball, varsity volleyball, and flag football, we all put up tough fights, but unfortunately we lost those matches. We're going to come back at them this week. So remember, student-athletes, you play how you practice, so practice hard. Congrats to the 21 athletes for competing in their first race yesterday. Special shout-out to the 5th and 6th grade boys teams for a 4th place team finish. Jeremiah George for a 3rd place overall finish. Katie Chan for a 6th place overall finish, and Fiona Lewis for a 6th place overall finish. Really good job all. Girls Volleyball, JV, and Varsity combined practices after school today from 4 to 5.15 on the Kindergarten Playground. Varsity Football practices after school from 2.50 to 4.30, meeting underneath the shade structure. Additionally, Thursday's practice is going to be a scrimmage style, and we need some students to play against. If you are interested in joining our practice, I will have a sign-up sheet outside of my room tomorrow morning. There will be only 10 spots available. Basketball Open Gym will be tomorrow after school. More on that tomorrow. As a school update, come join Doral Saddle this Friday, September 16th at 7.05 p.m. at the Aviators game. You can purchase your tickets for only $15 on the Doral Saddle PTSO homepage. That's going to be linked in the description below. And if you see Miss Ernst, wish her a happy birthday. Her birthday was on Saturday, September 10th. Have a great day, Dragons. Bye, everybody.